Today we'll see one of the real time use case that is Flipkart feedback using PLS scheme. In this use case, we'll cover two requirements that is feedback capture and top three best delivery performance. Let us see, discuss the use case. I have opened the Flipkart and once open the Flipkart, I have placed one order. Once order get confirmed, shipment will get ready. So order, order will deliver to me. Once, del once delivery executive delivered the order, a feedback message come to the registered mobile. So I have given the feedback based on the experience with the delivery guy. So once I have given the feedback that will be stored in, a, in the database. So in this requirement, we'll cover only this part, like giving the feedback and uh, that, data, that feedback will be stored in the database. So this is the actual message that once the order get delivered, we'll get one feedback message. So once we click the feedback link, like this, it will uh, it will display like whether I am satisfied with the delivery execute. Uh, so if I am have satisfied, I'll click I'm happy and I put one comment. So we need to store this data in our, in our database, like whether, uh, whether I'm happy with the service or not. So in this use case, I'm happy will come as three and average will come as two and I'm not happy will come as one, three, two, one, I'm giving the rating. So once I have given the feedback, I will get thank you for valuable feedback. This is the out message we need to display to the user. So if you want to solve this requirement, you should have a better understanding of the following concept, to care, order by for sorting purpose, DDL, data definition language to create any table, DML, data manipulation language to insert, update, delete, TCL transaction control language, that is commit or rollback. Processor, you should know what is processor, how to write a processor and how to execute a processor. In and out parameters, anonymous block, sysref cursor, cursor attributes, 12C feature we are using in our requirement, and group by class, having class and DBMS output. If you are familiar with this, with this concept, then the requirement will be easier to understand. So before going to the actual topic, let us understand this, some of the concepts, processor. This is a simple processor, create or replace processor, processor name, begin and DBMS and our, and our output output line, hello world. This is a sample hello world output. So if you want to see them by using anonymous block, we can able to execute this processor, begin, the processor name and then output will be hello world. So next one is the system cursor. It's a weak ref cursor. It is a pointer to the query result. The syntax would be like this, variable name and system cursor. Now let us discuss the first requirement. First requirement is to capture the feedback. So if you want to solve this requirement, we should create one table. That is flip code feedback details. So order ID and delivery user ID, delivery username. When, when the order has been delivered, that is the delivery date, feedback by the by whom the feedback has given at what time, feedback date, and the rating and the comments. So these are the important columns like feedback by and feedback date and rating are the comments. So th this table we need to create. Next the feedback capture. For this, I have created one processor, create or replace processor, processor name, flip code feedback. Order ID, delivery ID, delivery name. Rating comments, P message, output. So these are the input and uh, one output parameter, P message. So we need to insert those parameters into a table that is flip code feedback details table. So order ID, delivery user ID, delivery username. When the delivery date, feedback by feedback date. So these are the columns which are stored in the clip code feedback details. So delivery date and feedback date, I'm giving sys state so that it will be like sys state, it will capture sys state. So once everything done, I'm sending to the output like, thank you for your valuable feed. This is the out parameter. So now I'm executing the processor by using anonymous block declare. This is the feed processor name, flip what feedback. So the order ID will be like, uh, this is the generated system generated one, delivery ID, delivery name, and I'm giving rating three in the sense like good. 
service is good. I'm writing the comment service is good. Output the so if you want to see the result, what we'll do, the output will be like, thank you for your valuable feedback. This is the output parameter. So this is the output. So if you want to see in the database, well, see select star from Flipkart feedback details. I have given the order ID. So feedback, I mean, given a feedback day, 11th February, 2022. Service is good. So these are the, these are the details captured in a database. The second requirement is that uh, top three best delivery performance based on their feedback. So for this, I'll write one more processor, create or replace processor, processor name. Here processor name is top three best delivery performance. The requirement is that the year two input parameters that based on the year, like if I want to get 2022, like top three performance based on the year, like 2022 or 2021 or 2020. So based on the year, and also I need to have like number of deliveries based on number of deliveries also, we need to find whether the performance of that delivery execute is good or not. So for this purpose, I'm using sysref cursor. So from Flipkart feedback details, I need to get the, I need to capture those results. So where to care of delivery date. So I'm extracting here YY part so that, uh, so for, for the particular year, like if I want to, uh, for last year, like 2021, I want to get top three best performance. So for that purpose, I'm extracting the year part. So I'm uh, grouping by delivery user ID. So number of deliveries, sum of rating by count of deliveries. This is for rating purpose. So I'll explain like, this is like number of, based on number of de minimum deliveries, we need to consider rating. So order by rating descending. So fetch first three rows only. This is a 12C feature. It will extract only three rows. So I will explain one more time. From the Flipkart feedback details table, I need to extract the year so that we can pass for the particular year. I'm grouping by delivery user ID, number of deliveries, sum of rating by count of delivery user ID. The purpose of having class is to filter the uh, records based on like I'm filtering some condition like uh, based on particular, particular deliveries only, we need to consider this requirement. So order by rating descending. So this is a 12C feature. So my requirement has been fulfilled. Top three delivery. So by this procedure, we can display like top three performance, best delivery performance based on it. So if you want to execute by using anonymous block. Here I'm passing yet. I'm get I want to get 2022 20, top three best performance and minimum delivery should be 500. So result will be showed in uh so result result variable. Like if you like the content, subscribe and share the channels.